Hey there, thriller enthusiasts. Buckle up, because today we're diving deep into the world of Limitless and the hidden dangers of NZT48. If you've ever dreamed of unlocking your brain's full potential, this one's for you. So let me paint you a picture. Eddie Mora, played by Bradley Cooper, is a struggling writer who stumbles upon a miracle drug called NZT48. This little pill turns him into a superhuman genius, mastering everything from writing to finance in the blink of an eye. Sounds like a dream, right? Well, not so fast. With great power comes great side effects. Eddie's newfound abilities come at a steep cost. Memory loss, withdrawal symptoms, and a dangerous addiction. Imagine living on the edge, constantly looking over your shoulder because everyone wants a piece of your brain power. Loan sharks, mysterious figures, you name it. Eddie's life spirals into a chaotic game of survival. Now, behind the scenes, Limitless is based on Alan Glynn's novel, the Dark Field. Directed by Neil Berger and written by Leslie Dixon, it features a powerhouse performance by Bradley Cooper. Oh, and let's not forget Robert De Niro, who brings his A-game as Carl Van Loon, a cunning finance magnate. Visually, the film is a feast for the eyes. Special effects like fractal zooming and out-of-body experiences mirror Eddie's enhanced perception. It's like seeing the world through the eyes of a genius, but with a trippy twist. Released in 2011, Limitless is, was a box office hit raking in over $161 million worldwide. Its success even spawned a TV series diving deeper into the world of NZT48. But let's talk about the real kicker here. The film sparked debates about human potential and the ethical implications of cognitive enhancement. Imagine popping a pill to become the best version of yourself, but at what cost? The movie taps into our desires and fears about pushing human limits. Critics had mixed feelings. While some praised its visual style and Cooper's performance, others felt it didn't fully explore the moral dilemmas. Still, Limitless struck a chord, becoming a cultural touchstone for discussions on nootropics and self-improvement. In the end, Eddie appears to have it all, but the film leaves us questioning whether he truly escaped NZT48's grip. It's a cliffhanger that keeps you thinking long after the credits roll, so there you have it the allure and peril of unlocking your brain's full potential. If you haven't seen Limitless yet, it's a wild ride worth taking. Just remember, some shortcuts come with a hefty price. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more thrilling content. Catch you in the next video.